Hi and welcome to this week's look at what's making headlines in natural health on iHealthTube.com. Well, diet may hold a key to helping prevent the spread of one of the most deadly forms of breast cancer. Researchers found that limiting an amino acid called asparagine in lab mice with triple negative breast cancer reduced the ability of the cancer to travel to other parts of the body. The researchers used techniques like limiting asparagine found in the diet, among other techniques. Asparagine is found in dairy, wheat, beef, poultry, eggs, asparagus, and many other foods. However, most fruits and vegetables are low in asparagine. Researchers think limiting asparagine in the diet could be a useful therapy to help prevent the spread of breast cancer. Is alcohol healthy or not? Well, the answer to that question seems to change by the week, but a new study out of New York is showing that it might be okay to have that drink. New research is indicating low levels of alcohol can help reduce inflammation and clear toxins from the brain, including amyloid plaques, which are associated with Alzheimer's disease. The study was conducted on mice. Those that had the equivalent of about two and a half drinks a day showed less inflammation in the brain and more efficient movement of fluid through the brain that helps remove waste. The mice that were exposed to high levels of alcohol over a long period had higher levels of inflammation as well as impaired cognition and motor skills. Finally, drinking hot tea is often thought to be one of the most healthy drinks for you, but for some people it might be just the opposite. The study found that consuming hot tea is linked to an increased risk of esophageal cancer in those who also drink alcohol and smoke cigarettes. China is one of the areas with the highest esophageal cancer rates. Tea drinking Chinese men are also more likely to smoke and drink alcohol. The study looked at over 450,000 people and found those who drank hot tea while consuming excessive alcohol and smoked had an esophageal cancer risk more than five times greater than those who had none of those three habits. But the research also noted that in the absence of alcohol and smoking, daily tea drinking was not linked to a risk of esophageal cancer. That's a look at what's making headlines in natural health this week. Make sure to go to iHealthTube.com and sign up for our free email newsletter to stay connected to the latest.